Okay, so we got YouTube having uh, removed the uh, movie with David Cole was the Auschwitz death camp a lie. And uh, if you saw that report by a Jew, David Cole, you will know that uh, in fact it was an honest report. It was not a sham or attempt in any way to say something bad about the Jews or to uh, do anything that would be against community guidelines. It was an honest, factual report. Whether you agree with the content or not, that is up to the individual to decide. But it is not up to, supposedly, YouTube to judge whether or not you have the choice to judge free, factual information that is available for anyone to take a look at the evidence and decide. Let's see what we have here. It says, was flagged for us to, to review, and upon review, we determined that it violates our guidelines and we've removed it from YouTube. We know that this might be disappointing, but it's important to us at YouTube that YouTube is a safe place for all. If content breaks our rules, we remove it. If you think we've made a mistake, you can appeal and we'll take another look. And what, you, what happens when you do that, of course, is they just deny it, as they do every time. Uh, but um, it's, uh, there's, no, there's nothing in that movie, by the way. This is just, uh, let's see what it says. Content glorifying or inciting violence against other persons. See, this is, there's nothing in that. Uh, David Cole, a Jewish man making that report about the Auschwitz death camp. David Cole, a Jew, who, by the way, they beat up. They beat, they, they beat him up and they threatened him and everything and he had to leave the country. So who knows where he is now. I don't know where he is now. But they had, he had to leave the country because um, people were, um, you know, beating him up and, and, uh, and uh, you know, they were threatening him and everything and he, he, he left. But uh, the important thing to understand here is that there is nothing in this movie whatsoever that is um, inciting violence against another person whatsoever. Remember, a Jew makes this. David Cole is a Jew himself. So it can't, he's, he's not speaking against the Jews. He's speaking against what, what is a lie. Yeah, yeah, we know it might be disappointing that YouTube doesn't follow its own guidelines and uh, go, goes ahead and, and removes a video, which is an honest report. So uh, let's see, we also don't allow any content encur that encourages hatred of another person or a group of people based on their membership in a protected group. Okay, once again, David Cole's a Jew. Uh, we review educational, documentary, artistic, and scientific content on a case-by-case -case basis. Limited exceptions are made for content with sufficient and appropriate context where the purpose of the posting is clear. Well, the purpose of the David Cole report was, was Auschwitz death camp a lie? And by the way, in my opinion, it was. Uh, because uh, there's all kinds of detail that was left out of mainstream history. And to, for YouTube to remove this video is an unbelievable travesty. It is, it is totally against free speech. It is totally unrighteous. This report, if you saw, makes absolutely no inciting of hatred or um, anything that would break community guidelines. It's, he, David Cole goes over the facts about how the evidence that he was able to find and that he gathered with some other people scientifically done shows that the story that we were told about the Auschwitz camp simply isn't what mainstream history said it was. And uh, the fact that this video is now removed from YouTube represents a reality that YouTube, and, and by the way, this is not just a, a singular isolated event. I mean, the fact that my whole channel is isolated for no uh, violation of community guidelines whatsoever because I was showing that uh, our government and we have, uh, is controlled by non-humans because if the entire police force is, is uh, in on this uh, gang stalking that I got for uploading nothing but uh, non-humans to YouTube, then it means that uh, there's non-humans in control. 
Uh, and so they've isolated my channel so that very few people see it or find it. Uh, way fewer views than uh, other channels with a, a similar content, but that are much less well made and, and less convincing, but the same topic. And they have tons more uh, views for each movie. My very same thing happened to uh, a reporter, uh, Ben Swan. His channel used to have, uh, you know, all kind of like a, as many as 50,000, 75,000 views per movie. Now he's lucky if he can get 1,500 because uh, he started speaking against the mainstream narrative. So we are under lockdown, friends. The, the, the truth is under lockdown. You know, I, I should make a separate movie about this, but I will announce again here that YouTube is clearly not a friend of the truth. They are working for the satanic, wicked, evil government that wants to go along with with obscuring the truth about how our, our entire world and system is a terrible evil lie that is murdering people daily spraying stuff into the atmosphere retarding our children giving us cancer with gmo and technology that they know does uh and uh, it is just um it's just a nightmare friends and this is this uh, right here this this report by David Aus by uh, David Cole uh, was the Auschwitz death camp a lie. This is this is an unrighteous removal. If I appeal this, they'll deny it. I, I almost guarantee it. We'll see, but uh, and I'll report on it later. But this this report was if if you saw this report, you will see that it is it is nothing but a a, a honest factual look at the evidence. Which if you look at that evidence, you will see that the the mainstream story that we've been told is is just it's just a lie it's just not true and uh so they remove this now so that um so that now others cannot see this set because i i might not have been convinced if i didn't see this evidence so now uh, th th this ensures by the removal of this movie this ensures that that more people will not get to see the truth and know that our world history is a lie. We've been lied to, friends. Huge lies about World War II. Everybody uses Hitler and the Nazis as the ultimate bad guys. It continues on, on and on and on, with more books, more movies, more entertainment, more things. And it turns out that uh, it's all not what we thought it was. In fact, it looks like the opposite was true from what we were told, and that sounds outrageous, but I find that these opposite truths are what you get here. Uh, these, these, um, what they do is they actually accuse the innocents, innocent people of, what, of their own crimes. So they, they take their own crime and they actually make continued years and years long propaganda saying that it was them that was this great evil when in fact they were the ones who did it okay so uh i got this at the top of, of the uh page here on my uh dashboard it says we've made updates to our hate speech policy that may impact your content so as you know they've already deleted the david cole movie and then uh when you check out this look what uh, now, uh, we've always had policies that prohibit hate speech on YouTube. On June 5th, we announced some changes to our hate speech policies. And then uh, as you scroll down here, it says uh, hate speech is not allowed on YouTube. We remove content promoting violence or hatred against individuals, which uh, none of my movies do. And uh, I don't upload any content like that because I know that that's not allowed. But uh, uh, look what uh, they're going to say here. Look at this. Uh, here's some examples of... Uh, the kinds of content that they're not going to allow, okay? So here's some examples of hate speech not allowed on YouTube. I'm glad this violent event happened. They got what they deserved, referring to persons with the attributes noted above. Okay, now just think about that for a second. They could, they could say that about, it, about just about anything that they want. So if you say, you know, uh, like... Yeah, you know, the, uh, I mean, I think those people got what they deserve, you know. And just even just saying that, that's it. You're, you're guilty of hate speech on YouTube. It's not free speech, friends. I mean, by any, you know, in any sort of reasonable context of free speech, I realize you can't just say anything. And uh, there's, there's community guidelines. But, I mean, you could just say, 
oh, uh, you know, yeah, I mean, I think, you know, these people are going to, you know, like, what are we? I mean, all of my movies where I say, well, you know, people who think a certain way or do certain things, they're going to go to hell. Well, there's your there's your hate speech right there, and uh, your your movies are not allowed. So basically, what what this might boil down to is you can't say anything that's the truth, that's the, a negative truth. You can only say positive things on YouTube. That's what this is boiling down to. Okay, and then uh, it says here's here's another example: a person with attributes noted above are dogs. Well. <laughs> Or persons with the attributes noted above, which is again, you know, whether it's it's their it's their list here, uh, uh, age, caste. I mean, you could say you could say anything, race. I mean, you know, if you're saying something that's you know it has to do with somebody's, uh, yeah, let's just say you know, yeah, oh, you know, uh, gee, uh, you know, all all women are like that, you know. There's, you can have your your important content removed, you know, or, you know, something that you, that you wanted to express, that you wanted to stay up there, gone, okay? So it's, it, it really is, uh, is just not a, a tenable situation. I mean, they can, they can use this new policy that they have now to basically get rid of anyone that they don't like. See, if it's somebody who's a corrupt piece of crap like PewDiePie or whatever that craphead's name is, or, you know, somebody who doesn't post any sort of real hard truth uh you you know then uh you're going to be fine but if you do you're going to be see this see like let's say something something happened you know yeah and, and you happen to say you know well i'm i'm kind of glad that you know that that uh you know the the person of uh you know that person probably deserved it uh i mean you know unless you're saying something obviously racist but you know, you know, I'll I'll say again. You know, the the David Cole report, absolutely. I mean, here he is a Jew. He's not speaking against Jews, and and you know, neither is David Irving. He's not. He's saying that this what's happened is that we've been sold a huge lie, an ongoing lie, an unbelievable lie, uh, something that uh, automaker Henry Ford wrote quite well about in his book, uh, uh, the. Uh, the international Jew, and, and, and uh, you know, this, of course, I'm sure is flagged as major hate speech if you publish anything about that book, in which he had to buy his own newspaper just to get it published because the Jews all owned all the newspapers at the time and still do. And uh, so, you know, it's just, um, it's a situation where we've got, we have our free street, free speech to declare the truth about what's going on, especially in world history and World War II and, and World War I, and then currently uh, uh, all that's going on with the corruption and the, um, the satanic ritual abuse and all this stuff going on that, uh, you know, people, uh, you know, I can't even say it now, right? Because if, if I say, if I say this is because it's coming from the Jews, guess what? I mean, I'm a, I'm a hate speech person speaking against the Jews. But if we can't even report on this subject, because if you even mention a person of a particular race having to do with this issue, boom, your video is gone. There's no truth on YouTube. So I don't know, maybe we should all protest and just, you know, there's, there's you know, diverge to other platforms. But the fact of the matter is, that means a lot of the people that aren't awake to the truth aren't going to see it. So the, these wicked uh, beings have total control over the truth. These are devils that are in control. They're, they're the insectoids that have control over Google. They tell you right in the name, Google. Googly eyes. Insectoids. Okay, and then uh, so they also uh, threaten you that uh, any of, it's like if, if I leave the David Irving movies up, why? They can uh, get three strikes against my channel. And uh, that's it. But I mean, they could do that to the rest of my videos. So, it, but uh, they, here, here they're, uh, Threatening you, we encourage you to review all the videos in your account to make sure they are in line with our community guidelines as additional violations could result in strikes on your account or even lead to account termination. So if I speak the truth about the, uh, the false information that we're given about World War II uh, and, uh, and, 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 and I keep that content up, why they can take and delete my channel for me. Okay, and here we get to where it looks like they are uh, getting to the heart of why they deleted the David Cole report on Was Auschwitz a Lie? And it says, if you deny that a well-documented violent event took place. Okay, so if someone makes a report saying that a well-documented 
violent event took place. You could you could uh, delete anybody that uh, says that uh, that 9/11 wasn't what we all thought it was, or you know, and and especially if you say that uh, the Holocaust. Now uh, the the David Cole report or any uh, of the reports like the David Irving movies that I have on my channel, um, they don't deny that. Uh, a lot of people died. They just he just says that that probably a lot less than what we thought died and didn't die in the way that we thought they died. But this is is uh, probably geared exactly for the movies that show that the Holocaust was not what we thought it was. So that's exactly what this is. It denied that a well documented violent event took place. So that means that you can't you can't have a a different narrative about what happened. You can't present opposing views on a historical event at YouTube. This is what you get at YouTube now. So um, I think it's um, I think it's it's uh, it's it, it means that you can't tell the truth about certain things that they don't that the that the uh, Jewish Anti Defamation League probably is who's behind this or you know it's it's obviously a Jewish uh, controlled group that or it, it appears to be anyway that's behind this that's um, making sure that YouTube can't have any uh, policies that speak against the Jews and uh, so that's what I mean this is uh, this is like this is tailor made for the Holocaust deniers uh, or anybody like me who says, oh, well, maybe it's not quite what we thought it was, and the evidence shows that. You're not allowed to say that on YouTube. And uh, so you can have your channel deleted, and uh, it's just, um, it's just uh, not, not a, a place where the, uh, the, the truth is allowed. Anything that you say, like if you, you know, there's a difference between putting forward honest, you know, as, as honest as, as you find, you know, facts about an issue and, you know, being somebody who says, you know, oh, these uh, races are a bunch of dogs and, you know, it's okay if they get shot, you know, or something. Why don't they, you know, anybody who uh, talks, uh, who is in favor of, of the Talmud, I mean, that basically says that, uh, you know, all other races besides Jews are shit that um, people can just... You know they, that the Jews are allowed to, uh, you know, subjugate and, and rip off and everything else, and there's no violation with God. So uh, they need to take down uh, any uh, any uh, rabbis or anybody that's promoting the Talmud, because uh, that's that's what the Talmud. It's, the Talmud says that uh, a, a priest or a rabbi older can can rape a girl as long as she's under three years old and it doesn't count as rape. Um, you know, it's um, insanity, and uh, so that you know. They need to uh, focus on that as well, but, you know, of course they won't because uh, we know that um, what YouTube uh, actually is, unfortunately, is uh, they are not friends of the truth. I mean, that's what, that's what we have now, and uh, now I see why a lot of people are just leaving YouTube that, are, that want to publish the truth. The only problem is that YouTube is one of the main places that people can go. And uh, it's it's not free speech. We don't have free speech in America. You know, I I I became a target of psychological warfare and using law enforcement vehicles or what appear to be law enforcement vehicles. We find out later that there a lot of them are holograms, but uh, they're they're all in on it. I've encountered uh, police Los Angeles that I could tell that they knew who I was and uh, were not happy about me uh, reporting that they are apparently non-humans living among us. Uh, they want to keep the whole issue of, of uh, extraterrestrials, um, you know, down with a bunch of, uh, you know, crazy conspiracy theorist type people. So they're not going to accept it in mainstream academia, uh, mainstream news for the most part. Uh, they won't allow it. And uh, that's because uh, they don't want humans to, in general to wake up to the fact that they are under non-human control. Okay, so here's some more detail what you shouldn't do. Make violence the focus of your video. Gee, if you make a, a war documentary that, if you make a war documentary that goes along with the lies, bullshit uh, story that they've told us in history, oh, you're, probably, you're not going to get flagged. But if you make a, a video that has uh, the same content, in, even in a fair way, but it's got violence in it, well, then you're going to be flagged, and, and it's it's a don't do. Okay, so. It's, it's, it's entirely unfair. Um, and, and then uh, it says, try to shock or disgust your viewers. Gee, you know, you could say that about anybody's movie. You know, they, they might say, say that about 
somebody who uh, like Del Bigtree who's saying that uh, vaccines cause autism and all kinds of other health problems and you shouldn't vaccinate your kids and I, I agree with them. Uh, my mother was a medical doctor and she confirms his findings and, uh, and Del is a, is a hero. Uh, but guess what? Uh, that may be um, uh, that may be inciting people to uh, you know what YouTube might say is well that's that's uh, you know inciting shock that the oh, that the uh, vaccines that we're giving our kids is uh, causing them to become mentally retarded and, and weakened and destroyed and causing endless pain and suffering. But it's the injections that uh, are supposed to prevent disease. Uh, so uh, you know that could be that could be well. Guess what? That's uh, that's you know I, I would be shocked and disgusted by that disgusted by that information. And uh, well, if you uh, you know if they say well, it, it, Del Big Tree by saying that, why he's trying to shock and disgust his viewers. So I didn't know how far they were going to take this deleting videos, and uh, I got to say that um, I'm really turned off by this, and uh, I don't know if I'm going to continue on YouTube because uh, I mean you're you're at the mercy of. Um, these wicked people on YouTube that, uh, you know, all of us now in the truth community know that, uh, you know, YouTube is not a friend of the truth. Ultimately, uh, they allow some things, I guess that maybe it's like, it's a, it's a way to see who's going to be against them and then target them for destruction. They're, 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 it's, it's a war. They're fighting against the truth. They're fighting against goodness in this world. And, um, all the people that go along with them that want to stay asleep, that don't want to give glory to God, uh, that want to stay unrighteous, that uh, that they uh, don't believe in hell, and don't think they're going to go there. Uh, all those people are going to go along with it, and um, you know it, they'll all be wrapped up together with uh, people that want to believe the lies that they are spinning. And uh, those that uh, truly embrace the truth uh, are going to be, you know, they're they're not going to be part of that group. They're going to be separated, and that's what they do. They they separate people, and uh, they they isolate you, and uh, then they attack you, and uh, make sure that you're minimized so that all the people that want to stay asleep and continue their their unrighteous lives uh, can do so. But uh, I will say that the um, this uh, this thing with YouTube really turns me off, and uh, I'm uh, I think I might um, I might uh, quit on YouTube, and uh, you know go with another uh, platform that uh, doesn't. Uh, enact these uh, unrighteous policies. I don't know if it, 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 can, be, it can be done because the devils that control everything, they control all the money. Satan controls all the money, all the industry and everything. By the way, don't be fooled by that whole Huawei thing. They're just trying to distract from the fact that uh, cell phones cause cancer and uh, you shouldn't be using a cell phone in the first place and 5G is going to accelerate that um, cancer and, uh, and uh, uh, debilitating of humans. Uh, with all kinds of health problems, and uh, so everybody's like rooting for China. Yeah, we want to support China because they're, you know, they're uh, they're being victimized by the evil U.S. government. But meanwhile, the real story is that they want to distract from the fact that uh, 5G is really going to bring in uh, debil debilitating uh, aspects of this uh, already huge health problem that's been documented now that cell phones cause cancer. The airplane that you're hearing has uh, just shot a beam at my house. There's uh, this uh, creaking. This is what happens when they, they whatever these holograms are, or beams that they're shooting. They, you hear, you'll hear an airplane, and then you'll hear the walls creak or the windows creak. They're shooting some kind of beam at it. If you're watching this, it's not too late. Say this prayer now. Father in heaven, please save my soul by the work of your son Jesus on the cross and show me your pure words in the authorized King James Bible.